Right, here we are. Um, this is probably, uh, let's see, maybe about round about video six, I don't know. Have we got somebody to talk to? We can take this guy out. Teach him a thing or two. What can she teach him? So I don't understand this because it's ridiculous. Because, well, their fighting skills might be up as soon as she gets them. That's why she's getting these missions. Um, where does it want me to take him? Just within the confines of the camp. So, not really much point in taking a car. Uh, some people say they find it hard to find the way around this camp. I don't understand why, because it's quite simply laid out. Um, the AI seem to have difficulty finding the ways around. So, if you have one of them set your rescue missions, guard the guy back really carefully. So I'm going to get that all the time. Medicine storage exceeded. Just try and share out um, sneak to the next location. I hate this crap. I hate these sneaking missions. It's not nothing to do with anything. There's no fun from the stealth angle in this game at all. So he's just going to do that. And do I fail the mission if I run or not? No, let's have a look. Right, we'll sneak from here then. And does this succeed in giving him a a level up? Also, yeah. let's try some shooting. Yeah. I don't have a suppressor. There's no point in trying to shoot him in the head. Better get ready. We'll be on soon if we keep going this way. He's shooting me. The best tactic I find is not to go in the building. Not to get bitten, of course. Until you've got most of them away, let them come out to you. You get yourself killed, mate. Good. Let's get out of here. I think that was the building that I had my uh, outpost in before. We moved it over just to get just to get a little bit more. I'm only eating the snacks. Normally I would just rest up, but I'm only eating the snacks just to get this video moving on. If you go in that other far gate over there, where he's going. I took a guy in this way before when I did a search and rescue mission and he didn't make it. Look, he's not making it in here. Should 
should be able to chop his bits up. I'm going to leave the gate open. I've got some pills somewhere in one of the cars. Can't be bothered to go looking for them. Let's um. Take some. Not aspirins. Not methadones. I wanted some. Not mild stims. But I'll have one of those anyway. I suppose the morphines. Was in the guy. Wanted training. My God. Have you seen the guys when they're doing their exercising in the gym? How funny it is. Here I'm grunting away. Bagged any big ones? Come on. Whip them open around. I need your help. Bomb on them. I can do that. Just across at the helicopter base. I think we can do that one again without a car as well. See, you should be able to switch that character and look into their stuff, then switch back. But when you often do that, one of the things I find is that it, your character says, "Oh, I'm off now," and leaves you to it. Sort this guy out. Oops. Mm -hmm. <coughs> okay, now we're gonna kill some zombies the old fashioned way. Are we? This another hard up there. Ten harm, I thought so. I'm not gonna fight two hordes of zombies. And since we're, we can see the the run back. I appreciate your concern. It means a lot to me. Good. I got nothing left. No. So here we are back at camp. See what else is there is to do. I want to move that base outpost for to there. The uh, zombie hordes I just seen on the road are not showing on the map. So the way to do this is to go into one, two, three, four, outpost four and remove it.
and it would be right near the building that I want to be in so what I'll do is I'll take a car out with me and uh, this should be the last I do with this character for now Left the gate open, I know, but let them deal with it. Put the sirens on. Just to draw them all towards the car, of course. It's on the back. Thinks it's a taxi. Okay. And there's a few round there. But I think I wanted to put it in that building anyway Area secure. No so this is what I'll do is we'll put that My God. I couldn't get out of the car then, I was actually trying to get out of the car. Let's try this. Finally, finally! Let's get the safety of the car. We will go into the things. I say I've lost my machete, which I would have liked to have kept, so I could have put it in for repair. But it vanished so quickly, didn't have much choice. It's not letting me have that as a primary weapon. Put some inside the car, perhaps. Uh, yes, because I was inside the car, and also my primary weapon was meant to be my handgun. Now, if we just take a glance on the map, we can see that. Basically, all of these places are tied together now. Get them all to line up a little bit. Oh. 